Hi everybody, I'm Jeff Johnson for Clerk TV, and I have the privilege today to talk to Erica Woodford, who is the Clerk of Superior Court of Bibb County. How are you? I am well. It How are a, you? Thank you for coming up and talking to us today. Thank you. We are looking forward to finding out a lot about you, but first, let's get right into where in the world, or where in Georgia, is Bibb County? Well, where in the world is Bibb County? <laughs> Bibb County is in the heart of Georgia, so right smack dab in the middle. Really? Now, you know, I was talking to some, a couple of other people before, and it seems like there's this, a lot of counties that are surrounded, you know, that kind of join up with each other, of course. How do you get along with all the other clerks surrounding your county? Well, we get along great. Mm -hmm. You know, we communicate constantly with each other. If anyone has a question or concern, we are always open to each other's calls, emails, text messages communicate to help solve problems so that we can better serve our citizens. You know, th th there was kind of this thing, this kind of underlying current of a clerk family. Do you feel that? I do. I do. It's been prevalent these two years that I've been in the office. In those two years that you've been in the office, what have you seen change in Bibb County? Well, in Bibb County, we have seen a lot of changes from the technology in the clerk's office mm -hmm. um, to our actual governing body. So we've consolidated the government, but specifically in the clerk's office, we've changed and grown as far as technology is concerned. Like what? What, what are some of the great things that you've done? Well, for one, we now accept credit and debit card payments. That's a, That helps, <laughs> you know? Right. Yep. So, you know, um, our customers don't have to go to the bank or go to the convenience store to get a money order. They can now pay with their credit or debit card when they're paying their fees or fines. Mm -hmm. um, also, I'm so happy that we just rolled out a web-based payment program. And what is that all about? Well, from the comfort and convenience of your home. Uh-huh. In your pajamas and fuzzy slippers. Now see, that's comfort and convenience. That is very comfortable <laughs> and yet convenient. Yes. You can pay your child support, fees, fines, or restitution that you are ordered to pay through our court order payments receiver's office. So customers can log on to www.bibcountysuperiorcourtpayments.com and make those payments of child support. They do not have to get off work. Um, take special time off. They do not need to go, like I said, to the convenience store right. to get a money order. They can simply pay online or using their smart device, their iPad or their cell phone. You know what? All those things that you're talking about right there really bring the customer, the citizen, to the forefront. How important is it to you and your office and what you do to make sure the customer, the citizen, is taken care of? Well, every day in our office, we try to operate in excellence. Mm -hmm. We strive to provide efficient, prompt, and courteous service to our citizens. So whenever you come to the clerk's office of Bibb County, you will be greeted with a smile. I like that. Always good. And we <laughs> always try to help resolve your issue um, in a professional and prompt matter. Mm -hmm. You know, people don't want to come to the courthouse and linger all day. It's never pleasant. It's always yes. uncomfortable. Yes. You go through security. Um, you get pat down almost. Yes, indeed. You know, you see sheriff's deputies in the lobby, mm -hmm. attorneys, judges. And so it's not a comfortable experience right. coming down to the courthouse to transact business. So we, again, try to offer that prompt professional service to the citizens so that they can get their matter resolved. You know, we were talking a little bit earlier too, you also have a bilingual service. You've got you, it's a lot of your staff. This is, might be an opportunity to talk a little bit about your staff, how important they are to you, but that's a big deal these days. Absolutely, when I took office um, in January of 13, mm -hmm. I knew that it was very important to be able to communicate with the citizens yes. who use our services. And so in that respect, I thought that it was very necessary for us to find a bilingual deputy mm -hmm. clerk to work in that office to communicate with those people, Spanish-speaking citizens, who do not speak English as their first language. Right, right. How many uh, deputy clerks do you have? We have 28 staff in our office, 
and those <laughs> ladies and gentlemen yes. are quite fine people. Yes. They go above and beyond. Every day I get calls from citizens who use our services mm -hmm. to commend certain employees who work there. That's great. So, you know, we, we all try to operate in excellence. We all strive to provide that good service to the citizens. And I'm just pleased to have inherited such good a people. great staff. That's what it's all about. Let's talk a little bit about you. What are some of your hobbies? This is a fun, these are my fun questions that I always get to ask. What kind of hobbies do you have? Because people want to know, we want to know. So what are your <laughs> favorite hobbies? What do you like to do? Well, I love to cook and I love to eat. I, me too. So, <laughs> but I like to cook with fresh ingredients that my father grows. Oh, nice. So I like to plant things. I like to see th things grow. Mm -hmm. And I like to cook those things that my father and I plant. So what's your favorite? What, what, what's your favorite thing to cook? Gumbo. Really? Gumbo. Now, what type? Well, are there different types of gumbo? There, because I've had chicken gumbo, seafood gumbo. What's your favorite? I like a combination. I it's like to the add <laughs> the sausage, the chicken. I love it. And all the seafood. So. Well, the next I, time I we like have that. you on Clerk TV, we need that pot of gumbo. We you will need bring, to bring it. bring it on in here and do whatever. Hey, we'll I want to, I want to give you an opportunity to look right in that camera and talk to your constituency, all your citizens, and say whatever you like to say. Well, I'd like to tell the citizens of Bibb County that I am so humbled and honored to serve you. Every day that I go to work, every day that I interact with the jury, when I interact with the title abstractors, all of the citizens who use our services, I am so pleased not only to serve you, but to just meet you and interact with you daily. So I count it a blessing to be able to serve the citizens of Bibb County, and I hope to do it for many, many more years. Thank you so much for being with us today. We do appreciate it. Thank and you. And thank you folks for watching us on Clerk TV.